really well, really confident. Um, you know, I've had some minor setbacks, but you know, those, those sort of things are supposed to happen to, you know, uh, to point out the, you know, the areas that you need work on, and you know, for 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 me to grow as a person and an MMA fighter, you know, I have to take those ups and downs, and you know, I'm I'm pushing forward for a victory. You know, I got a good, tough opponent. You know, uh, really, I uh, heard a lot about him. You know, but. When, when, when we get in the cage, man, it, it's not personal, it's business, you know, this is, this is my career, you know, this is my life, you know, my family is messing with. And see, you, you've gone to the big show, you know, you've had a taste and everything, and, and uh, maybe not as successful as you wanted it to be, but, you know, does that make you hungrier when you step into the cage? Oh, absolutely, you know, uh, uh, it definitely humbled me, you know. Uh, I started off really good on the street, you know, got a little, you know, arrogant, you know, just, Jumped in, not trained as hard, you know, underestimated my, my opponents. Um, but I learned from that. Um, you know, I'm, I've, been, I've been walking that fine line, you know, being great and staying where I am right now. I'm ready to look past it. You know? I'm ready to go up there, raise my hand with the you know, number one contender in the world. Show what, what Marshall, Texas, you know, is truly about.